Oh, hello. It's getting cold outside again. River is freezing up. So, usually it doesn't freeze super fast, but all that ice starts flowing down. And it's a little narrow here, so it starts clogging up, as you can see. Yeah. Toby Tuesday. Go get Toby. Got some good questions from you guys this week. Let's do it. Snoo, 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 Toby. Hey, Tobes. How you doing? How you feeling? That's good. Snoo, snoo, snoo. We're going to the greenhouse today because it's a little breezy out here. Isn't it, Toby? Yeah, clean this place up. She is messy. Hey, Tobes, you want to clean her up? Clean her up, bud? Should have got my, should have wore my Dunlop boots. She's a bit snowy everywhere. Hey, looks like my hair. Neat. All right, Toby Tuesday. It's Tuesday, Toby. He doesn't know what's going on. So we got some good questions. Um, yeah, it's January 2017. We got some, I got the wheels in motion, no sled yet, but I've got other plans. So you guys will know soon enough. I'll let you know, I'll make an announcement. But uh, yeah, hope everyone's been enjoying the videos and I can't wait for the snow to melt actually. I, I wanna get back on my dirt bike and do fun things. I feel like I've just been stuck at home doing, doing nothing, reading books. Hi, right, Job. There he is. There you are. Wanna read some questions, bud? Yeah. Yeah. Good boy. Good boy. All right. What do we got here? What are you looking at? <laughs> questions. Polaris King 25. Are you worried about your YouTube? Your past videos used to get more views. Nope, not at all, actually, you know. Um, it was a hectic summer. We did a ton of videos. And uh, after I broke my back there, I just kind of wanted to take a break. Someone decided they were gonna make, they were gonna call me while I was filming. So I put my phone on airplane mode. Anyways, yeah, after I broke my back there, I just kind of wanted to take a break. You know, it definitely was a heavy injury and yeah, I just needed some time, so we're gonna ramp it up again. And apparently a lot of people have been having trouble with uh, loss of views lately. Um, apparently YouTube changed their algorithm and people aren't getting as many views as before, but I got some tricks up my sleeve. We're gonna, we're gonna pull out. And uh, I think 2017 is gonna be a big year. And I'm excited. And I hope you guys are excited too, so. We'll bring Matt back on as my camera guy and we'll do some crazy stuff. Um, Keegan Blanchard, what made, what made you want to start a YouTube channel? We've had this question a couple times before, but uh, well, I started filming videos like a long time ago. I stole my dad's video camera and started filming stuff. And then I'm like, you know what? I need to go to film school. So. I went to Vancouver Film School for a year, then I took two years off, then I went to Fanshawe, took some film, and right before that, I was, uh, yeah, my one of family friends said, why don't you, well, I had a YouTube channel, actually, just mainly for my friends to watch the videos we were making, and then uh, YouTube came out with the partnership program, where um, basically you got paid to make videos, so I was like, I can do that. So I started making videos and then I got accepted for a partnership and here we are. Right, Tobes? That's when you were just a puppy. You were a little puppy, Toby. Toby the puppy. Um, Will Mitchell, can fans send you stuff like fan mail and whatnot? Yep, uh, I don't really advertise it that much, but a lot of people do send me fan mail and little custom gifts and pictures and paintings and stuff. I, um, I used to read it out on the videos, but that took a lot, a lot, and uh, yeah, but you guys can send me stuff, I'll read it and enjoy it. Um, I usually don't write back, but thank you guys for sending me all that stuff. Um, if you guys do want to send me any fan mail or 
letters or pictures or paintings or drawings, um, I'll put my shipping address below and I will check that stuff out. Um, Nicholas Haynes, in your recent sled video, what kind is the black sled with the 799 on it? Um, that's Stahl's Pro Mod Sled. It's a Skidoo 600 race sled and uh, it's, it's obviously modified for racing pro class. So yeah, it's got a, a lot of custom stuff and twin pipes and stuff. That's why it's so sweet and awesome and loud and fast and cool and ridiculous. All right, last question. Um, salty Potato. What kind of boots do you wear? That's a good question because I wear a couple different kinds of boots. These boots are old. I got them in Aspen actually. I was training in Florida and then my boss called me. He's like, hey, we need you to go to the X Games. I'm like, yeah, man. So I had to fly from Florida to the X Games and all I had was my Florida gear. So I had to go and buy some warm stuff. These are just Irish setter boots. They're awesome. They've lasted so long. They're kind of ugly now, a little beat up, but super comfy. And then I run those FXR race boots for snowmobiling, the black and gray and kind of green high vis. They're super comfy. Um, then my orange boots are Dunlops, so they're just rubber boots and they're rated to like minus 40 and I wear them sledding all the time, so yeah, that's basically what I wear. I think I have some Denver Haze too, but uh, thank you guys for the questions. Um, enjoy the videos. Hope you've been enjoying the sledding ones. Be sure to watch the videos at the end of this one and hopefully I can make that announcement soon and yeah, get you guys all excited again. And then the snow's gonna melt, and we're just gonna have a great day. Toby, you gonna have a great day? Yeah. All right. Thank you guys again. Check out the links below, and we will see you next week.